Can a plant sense your thoughts? In 1966, a man hooked a plant up to a lie detector, and what happened next sparked one of the strangest scientific debates of the century. Let's talk about Cleve Baxter and the experiment that made plants talk. Cleve Baxter wasn't a botanist. He was a CIA interrogation specialist, trained to detect stress and deception using polygraphs. Lie detectors. One night on a whim, he hooked his office plant, a dracaena, up to a galvanometer, a device that measures electrical activity, often used in lie detection. He wanted to see how long it would take water poured into the plant's pot to reach the leaves. But what he saw shocked him. As the plant sat wired to the polygraph, something unexpected happened. Baxter had a thought. He imagined burning one of the plant's leaves with a match. He didn't say it out loud. He didn't move. And yet, the polygraph spiked. The plant reacted as if it had felt fear. He hadn't even touched it. To test the theory further, Baxter conducted more experiments, some where he harmed other plants or even small organisms nearby. Each time, he claimed the original plant showed stress on the polygraph. Was the plant reacting to energy? Emotion? Intention? Baxter believed this was evidence of primary perception, a kind of awareness beyond what science had ever acknowledged. The scientific community was deeply divided. Many dismissed the experiment as pseudoscience. No peer-reviewed studies replicated it under strict lab conditions. But Baxter wasn't alone. Other researchers tried similar tests and got curious results. Whether it was flawed science or a glimpse into a deeper truth, the experiment forced people to ask, do plants feel more than we think? Can they sense emotion? Is consciousness more widespread than we realize? Baxter's experiment didn't prove anything definitively, but it cracked the door open on a possibility that plants aren't just alive, they might be aware. Follow for more strange experiments that make you rethink what it means to be conscious.